Okay, back with some basics again. So we kind of alluded to in the push-up primer, we're gonna talk about shoulder extension or what's known as protraction. You're actively taking your shoulder blades, wrapping them forward, using them to extend your arms. The muscles of the back are far stronger than the muscles on the front. They're also the most important for stability and health. Take care of them, learn how to use them. So to begin working on that, we're gonna get back in that push-up position that we've done already. Keep your arms straight, keep your body tight. Allow your shoulders to come back as far as is comfortable. Push down as far as you can go. Now in the beginning, some people aren't used to this, are gonna have a very small range of motion. Now if you watch my shoulders, I can go back and go forward. Some people are going to have this very shallow range. That's all right. The range of motion will come with time. You just have to work on it. If you have shoulder problems, this can be significantly helpful to quite a few people. Give it a try. Again, if it hurts, there's any pain, there's something wrong. That's something you have to see a doctor for. Just to make sure it's nothing serious, you have no other problems going on. Again, push-up position. If you find it's hard on your wrists, you can turn your hands out a little bit for these. Back, shoulders up. Same thing, tight glutes, though. Keep your body tight. Get really good, hold that position. Now hold it, tighten your body, tighten your glutes. You can even lean forward a little bit on your toes and hold it. You'll feel the rotation of the shoulder blades activate. You'll also feel your core start to activate. 